Joanna, Narcan was used on three people in this one car. It was used on the driver who crashed and narrowly avoided a great deal of tragedy. Tire blown, windshield shattered. It was very surreal, I guess. Josh Kaplan was cashing at Gate Circle Wine and Liquor about 2.30 Sunday when police say this black BMW sideswiped two cars and crashed into a light pole right in front of the store on Delaware Avenue. Kaplan says he ran outside and saw firefighters giving someone CPR. It was, it was a bit nerve-wracking. Even more nerve-wracking, police revealed the driver of this car was coming down Delaware, driving by the liquor store, past out behind the wheel. Two other people in the car were also passed out, all three police say from a suspected overdose. Pictures sent to us from the scene show crews used Narcan to revive those three people. Buffalo firefighters say they're using Narcan on a daily basis and sometimes four to five times a day. It seems like it's unfortunately becoming a more of a regular occurrence and uh, should be. Matthew Hubeck is the manager of the liquor store. Every day workers there see runners whiz by, children walking with their families and dogs with their owners. Hubeck says it bothers him knowing the extreme damage this driver could have done. It's just upsetting that we have to live in a world like that where you know, people don't think about anyone else but themselves and make crazy decisions. All three of the people involved in this crash were taken to the hospital. Their names have not been released. Police say charges are pending against each one of them. I guess it happens, but I hope those people go to jail, you know. Buffalo firefighters say heroin has become an epidemic in the city. They say its use is most prevalent around the first of each month and is affecting every neighborhood citywide. Edge Ranch, 7 Eyewitness News.